Welcome to the magical world of Bright Star, a world where kids learn valuable life lessons while having fun in Bright Star. Know it alls! Farm animals! Hello there. Do you know what kind of animals can be found on a farm? Say, say, I have an idea. Let's find out together. Open your books to the first page and follow along as I read. Oh, and uh, remember, when you hear the sound of the cowbell, turn the page. Rise and shine. The sun is coming up. There's so much to learn about farm animals. Farm animals help to provide lots of different foods, services, and products that we can use. Do you know which of these farm animals like to squeal and roll in the mud? Turn the page to find out. Pig families. A mother pig is called a sow. A father pig is called a boar. And a baby pig is called a piglet. A mother pig can give birth to 8 to 12 piglets. One mother pig gave birth to 37 piglets at the same time. A whole group of pigs is called a herd. What do pigs eat? Pigs eat plants or animals like corn, potatoes, grains, grass, eggs, frogs, snakes, and fish. Fun farm facts! Pigs are sensitive to the sun and don't have any sweat glands, so they roll in the mud to keep cool. Pigs have poor eyesight, but they have a highly developed sense of smell. They are used by some police departments to sniff out drugs. The smallest pig is the pygmy pig. The largest pig is the giant forest pig. <laughs> Foods and other products that come from pigs. Bacon, pepperoni, pork chops, ribs, sausage, ham. Pig hair is sometimes used to make paintbrushes. Do you know which farm animal eats for about eight hours each day and can weigh up to 1,400 pounds? Turn the page for the answer. Cows are large farm animals. They eat a lot of corn, grass from the pasture, and hay. Cows regurgitate their food and re-chew the cud to help with digestion. A Holstein cow has spots that are like a fingerprint or a snowflake. No two cows have exactly the same pattern of spots. Cows usually live for about six or seven years, but they could live 25 years if people let them. Cows can detect odors up to five miles away. The cow must be a mother before she will produce milk. 
A whole group of cows is called cattle. Female, heifer. Baby, calf. Male, bull. Foods and other products that come from cows. Meat, hamburger, steak, roast, and sausage. Milk used in cheese, ice cream, sour cream, and yogurt. Other parts of the cow are used to make butter, soup flavoring, chewing gum, leather, soap, cosmetics, buttons, photographic film, sandpaper, and violin strings. What other animal gives us meat that we can eat? Turn the page. Chickens. Which came first, the chicken or the egg? What do you think? Foods and products that come from chickens. Eggs, meat, fried, roasted, Boiled, nuggets, soups, stews, frozen patties, breasts, wings. Can you guess what chickens eat? Chickens have a well-developed gizzard, a part of the stomach that contains tiny stones to grind up their food. Did you know most chickens can't fly? Instead, feathers help protect the chicken from getting too cold or wet. The chicken also has a comb, growth on top of the head, and wattles, growth under the chin, to help keep the body cool in the hot summer months. There are over 150 different breeds, sizes, and colors of chickens. A group of chickens is called a flock. Why did the chicken cross the playground? To, to get, get to, to the, the other, other slide. slide. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know which female animal can grow a beard? Turn the page to find out. A goat. A female goat, a doe or a nanny, can grow a beard. A female goat can have two kids in a year and can weigh between 22 and 220 pounds. Baby goat, kid, just like a young girl or boy. Some notes about goats. Goats have excellent night vision. Goats can run and climb and can jump over five feet high. Goats can stand on their back legs to reach tree branches. Some goats have horns and others do not. Goats eat corn, oats, hay, grass, alfalfa, and weeds. <coughs> male goat, a buck or a billy. The male goat has a beard and can weigh between 27 and 275 pounds. and products that come from goats. Goat's milk, meat, wool, leather and fiber for clothing. Can you guess which other animal gives wool to keep us warm? Turn the page to find out. Sheep. Sheep wool is used in clothing, like sweaters, mittens, and pants. The sheep has a thick coat of fleece on its body. Wool is fire resistant and will not burn. Easy. Easy, girl. More products we get from sheep. Carpet and yarn from sheep wool. Lamb chops, ribs, and sausage. Yogurt and cheese from sheep milk. 
candles, and soap from sheep fat. Sheep are very gentle, and they are easily frightened, especially by other animals. There are about 900 different breeds of sheep. Sheep have poor eyesight, but an excellent sense of hearing. Sheep move in large groups called flocks. A lamb knows its mother by her bleat, or the sound she makes. Female, ewe, baby, lamb, male, ram. Sheep beware, predators, coyotes, wolves, and domestic dogs. Giddy up, here come the horses. Do you see a baby horse? It is called a foal, a colt, male or a filly, female. The stallion is the adult male horse, and the adult female is called a mare. A group of horses is called a herd. A pony is a small horse, of course. Give me a hand. A horse's height is measured in hands. One hand is equal to four inches. How many hands and inches tall are you? What else can you measure in hands? What do horses munch for lunch? Menu. Grass, barley, bran, hay, oats, maize, corn, plant roots, fruits and vegetables like carrots and apples. What do horses do? Turn the page to find out more about these hard-working animals. Horses do many things on the farm. They can walk, trot, canter, a jogging or running pace, and gallop. That's not all. Horses are also very strong and can pull heavy things on the farm or in forests. Did you know? Horses are also used for entertainment, like in horse races or for people who like to ride on their backs. Sometimes parts of a horse are used to make dog food. Can you name three different kinds of birds that might live on a farm? Turn the page to find out. Duck, duck, goose. Don't forget the turkey. Ducks, hen, female duck, drake, male duck, plumage, the male duck's colorful feathers that attract females, duckling, baby duck, waterfowl, animals that can be found near ponds, marshes, streams, oceans, and rivers, webbed feet, paddle-like feet that help ducks swim, Did you know ducks have waterproof feathers? What can ducks and geese give us? Ducks. Meat, eggs, feathers for pillows and blankets. Duck oils can be used to make soap. Geese. Meat, eggs are used for crafting. Down or feathers are used for pillows. Blankets and clothing like gloves, hats, jackets. Geese. 
gosling, baby goose, molting, when adult geese lose their wing feathers in June. Migration, when geese fly to warm places for the winter. Predators, fox, raccoon, owl, and snapping turtles. I'd like an order of slugs, snails, and worms with a baby rat for dessert. <laughs> I'll have the insects, a snail, a fish, and a side of seeds. <laughs> Turkeys. The adult female turkey is called a hen. The adult male is called a tom. A group of adult turkeys is called a rafter. Baby turkeys are called poults, and they live in groups called a brood. The male turkey has a long waddle, bright colored skin that hangs from the neck. Male turkeys are also more colorful than the females. Fun turkey facts! Turkeys feed on insects, plants, corn, wheat, and seeds. Wild turkeys can fly, and they roost, or sleep in trees. Turkeys do not like water or cold weather. A mother turkey can lay about 9 to 18 eggs in a clutch, a set or a cluster of eggs, in a nest made of dried leaves and grasses. Foods and products that come from turkeys. Meat like turkey burgers, ground turkey, roast turkey, smoked turkey, and deli meat. Turkey parts can be used to make oils for automobiles. Farm animals help to make lots of different products for people. People need to respect and help farm animals too by making sure that they have plenty of food and water, a clean and safe place to live, and a healthy life is free from disease. Some people have formed groups that help protect farm animals from cruel treatment, stress, pain, and unhealthy slaughter. The groups also help to protect the people and the environment from chemicals used on factory farms. <laughs> Thanks for visiting Bright Star. Come back soon and often. We'll be waiting for you. <laughs>